Okay, it's time to talk about some bullshit. We make everything gay. We make everything gay. Captain America is not gay. He shipped with Peggy. Canonly. Iron Man has Pepper. They aren't gay. Dr. Watson and Sherlock each have a love interest. They are not gay. Every single Disney princess and prince are together. And they are not gay. Elsa, who is rumored to possibly ever have a girlfriend, does not have a girlfriend. Spider-Man? Deadpool, both their actors fought for them to have some sort of gay representation. Did not. Our community makes everything gay. But why do we change and make everyone gay? Why do we feel the need to make everyone gay? Is it just because we're all like fetishizing it and we're all perverts and we just like love to see two men together? No, absolutely not. That has nothing to do with it. We make everything gay because there has never been a gay Disney prince. There has never been a TV show about someone who is openly gay and it's made it in the big box office. There's not been any action movie with a gay, like, male superhero who falls in love with some other male who consents to him. There's never been a sort of lesbian, like, sweet romance, or there's not been enough anyways. I guess there's been co a couple of each of those, but there's never been enough. There's never been a widespread acceptance and showcase of a beautiful gay relationship. There's never been a cute Disney moment about two girls singing about each other. But you know what happens all, all the time in real life? Girls sing sweet songs about each other. Boys fall in love with each other. We need to be, as a population, someone who is more willing to accept the LGBT, com LGBT community. It needs to be understood that we will keep making things gay if we don't get any representation because we have to create our own representation we have to show ourselves that it's okay to love another woman or love two guys to love each other or it's okay to be trans we need to keep creating characters so that way we feel some sort of like wholeness and belonging it's unfair so far as a population to have such little representation in media it's bullshit it's about time that we started making everything gay because it's more than you think that are actually interested in like the other uh side of the spectrum we have plenty of straight people who might have like thought about it or dabbled in it we all know you watch gay porn occasionally y'all you aren't sneaky i will not stop making things gay and we as a generation and as a community in whole including all the generations all the wonderful people will not stop making it gay until we get representation i need a gay disney prince or princess i need to have an action hero who is not a flamboyant fashion designer i want someone who is the typical masculine guy who actually loves another guy and it can be that other stereotype but we are more than just stereotypes we aren't just butches and femmies we aren't just like hey guys no we are a whole people of diversity <laughs> the wind picks up as i get that we need to have someone who we can relate to growing up it's unfair that we've had to spend our whole life in the shadows and not knowing what a sweet like gay relationship could be it's not even bad for you heteros. It's so good for you guys to have multiple like ideas of what a relationship could be because then maybe you wouldn't be stuck in your shitty one. Not to say all hetero relationships are shitty. And not to say any gay relationship is not shitty. But it's about time that kids have the right to stop killing themselves over feeling like they're different and weird. It's about time that adults started accepting themselves before getting into 40-year marriages and then destroying them because they finally figured it out. We need to normalize it. It's not a fetish, and it's not something that's just sexual. It's just a people.